And as you guys can see right here, we are now level 100 in Fortnite Chapter 3. If you're watching this video in Chapter 3 Season 1, you have to drop a like on the video right now. If you don't drop a like, you're going to have bad luck all season and you won't even get to Tier 100. Don't risk it. Drop a like. Yo, 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 ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another video here on the channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys the absolute best and fastest ways to level up here in Chapter 3 of Fortnite. So in today's video, we're going to be seeing how many times we can level up in one single video. And I know what you guys are thinking. You guys are thinking to yourselves... What do you mean you can level up fast? You're only level two. Well, guess what? Just stick around in the video and I promise you by the end of this video, we are going to be at least level 15. So as you guys may or may not know, I try to gift at least five of our subscribers every single day when the item shop resets here in Fortnite. We actually just went insane gifting over 15 people the brand new chapter 3 battle pass. If you guys want to have your chance at getting yourself a free skin here in Fortnite, simply subscribe to the channel with all notifications on, like the video, and then just comment your epic username down below in the comments, and then you guys will have your chance at getting a free skin. Alright, so the first thing I want to show you guys is pretty much the quests on your screen. Basically, whenever you guys go into a game, you guys will have a bunch of quests to complete. If you guys open your map and then go over to the left with your bumper once, you guys can see all of your quests here. You guys have the daily, the season, the shanta, and then the milestones. As you guys can see, the milestones grant 20,000 XP for every single challenge you complete. For the man says the same thing, another 20,000. The season is 55,000, and then daily is 15,000. So make sure you guys definitely take advantage of these during Supercharge Week, or just whenever you guys have Supercharge XP, and you guys will gain loads and loads and loads of XP. Another thing I do want to show you guys is pretty much whenever you guys see a chest, an ammo box, or a food crate, or even just a freezer with like fish in it do not break it so like if a chest is on something and you guys normally you'd break it to open it quicker don't do that just open the chest normally and as you guys can see right there we just gained 135 xp it might not be a lot but it does add up so make sure you guys do actually open your items like your ammo boxes chests and food crates instead of breaking them to get more xp Another thing I do want to let you guys know is whenever you guys see on your map all of the gray areas, okay, especially the ones with the question marks, all right? So on your map, if you guys haven't played very much yet in the chapter, pretty much like this place over here, Camp Cuddle, such as other places such as Shifty Shafts, just everywhere that has a question mark or like three question marks on it, make sure you guys land at that specific point of interest. If you guys land there, you will be granted 15,000 XP for every single place with a question mark here you guys land at and then even with these like all these other gray areas will grant 2000 xp so um yeah make sure you guys do go to every single question mark on your map uh oh we got a player the batman skin geez buddy oh here's another one bro come on man another good way to earn xp this season is by landing at places like the sanctuary that have an npc or a boss to fight so places like the sanctuary are going to have bots just like this all around the poi if you guys do eliminate these bots you will receive pretty good amount of xp so make sure when you guys land here just go ahead and eliminate all of the bots if you guys don't know how the tents work yet either, basically how these work, if you throw them on the ground once you find them, you can go ahead and manage your storage. Once you guys do manage your storage, you guys will have two slots to put any weapon in, alright? So basically, let's say I want to put this AR in there. But now it's in there. If I break this tent, it's going to be gone, right? I cannot pick it up. But if I find another one in any previous game, or any, not previous, but any future game, I, it will still be in there. Like, I can literally go ahead come in here take it out and i'll still have it so like i could get eliminated this game five games later i can find another chest then i can go ahead or not another chest but another tent throw it down 
and then take my AR out of it. I think that's pretty sick. Let me know what you guys think about that down below in the comments. <laughs> oh my gosh, that is so unfortunate for that guy, man. Jeez, buddy. GG's buddy. Another good way you guys can earn XP is by whenever you guys are doing your quest, right? Whenever you guys are completing all of your challenges, make sure you guys are in a party with your friends, okay? Because when you guys are with your friends, whenever they complete their quest, the XP that they would earn for that quest, you also will earn as well if you guys are in a party with them. So make sure if you guys are with, like if you guys have friends, make sure you guys go ahead and play with them in your games and you can earn their xp and then they can also earn your xp as well oh gg's buddy let's go gg's buddy get out of here watch this it's a, it's a gg chat watch he's not, he's clueless this smg is too good the smg is too good chat it's it's literally too good oh we got another player the SMG is going to shred him. Is it going to do it? I think so. And what do you know? It shredded him. Let's go. There's another person. Is it going to happen again? Is it going to happen again? Of course it happens again. This SMG is way too good, man. It is too easy. It's too easy. The SMG, I don't even have the good AR. The shotguns are too bad. They're, they're literally terrible. And as you guys can see right here, after doing what I just told you guys for a couple of hours, I am now level 30. If you guys put all of these tips and tricks together and use them all at the same time, every single time you guys play a game, I promise you guys will level up in no time at all. If you guys enjoyed today's video, make sure you guys do drop a like and let me know down below in the comments, what is your favorite skin in the battle pass from this season? I hope to see you guys in the next video or live stream here on the channel. Binyabarains and I'm out. Peace.